please subscribe and press the bell icon for more content. Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. In today's video, we are going to learn how to make a creative A4 size flyer design in Microsoft Office PowerPoint. First of all, open your PowerPoint, you can see here. Then select the this area and press delete button. Then go to the design and click the slide size and click the custom slide size and choose the E4 size paper and click the protect tick option here. Then click the OK and click the maximize. You can see here. Then our page is ready for design now. Then make a design here. Then I go to the insert and simple I choose the shapes and I choose this the rectangle rounded rectangle shapes here. You can see this is a rounded rectangle shapes here then i draw this shapes something like this you can see here then this point is the increase here decrease here you can see here increase decrease here then i decrease this size here and this also size is decrease here maybe like this you can see and now rotate this maybe like this you can see here then zoom out your page here and drag the over here maybe like this you can see later it increase the size maybe like this you can see here something like this and little bit down it something like this and a bit and press ctrl command to duplicate here and now then click the format and go to the shape outline make it no outline here press ctrl command to duplicate here and little bit increase the size here maybe like this you can see here something like this this one is the our shape design is here something like this one here maybe like this you can see then press the control or command to duplicate here and drag it here something like this and zoom it and increase the height this maybe like this you can see then press ctrl command D duplicate here and little bit down it and little bit this down also here you can see then click the shapes and press ctrl command D duplicate here maybe like this and little bit increase the height this one is here maybe like this then press ctrl command D duplicate here and there is is uh, this one is here maybe like this and press ctrl command to duplicate here and this is increase this here maybe like this something like this and press ctrl command d duplicate here and this is this is drag it here maybe like this something like this and press ctrl command D duplicate here and little bit increase this one is here and down it something like this and press ctrl command D duplicate here and drag it over here and little bit increase the height something like this you can see then press ctrl command D duplicate here and drag it here something like this here and this is increase decrease the height here maybe like this you can see then you can see here and select the overall this shapes and I select this the text shapes here and go to the format and click the mask shapes and click the unit on here the, you can see here this is our it's all group this shapes here and click this the insert and go to the shapes and click the rectangle shapes here and draw the shapes something like this you can see here then go to the choose again rectangle shapes here and draw the shapes something like this you can see and first click this shapes here you can see click this shapes and hold the control button and click this shapes and click this shapes you can see here this is all merge this the shapes here and click the more shapes and go to the subtract here you can see you this is our shapes here something like this you can see then put the pictures on this shapes here and click the shapes go to the format and click the say fill and go to the pictures here you can see then choose your pictures whatever you want this pictures something i choose this one pictures is here and click this insert you can see 
then click this small icon you can see here and go to the fill option is here and choose the texas or texture fill option is here this is a rotate option is here this texas is simple rotate here maybe like this you can see and you can go to the format and choose this the crop option you can increase or decrease this pixels height here maybe like this you can see here and then click this the arrow button and increase the height here and decrease the height here you can use the any decrease or increase this height something i choose this right is the increase here maybe like this you can see then close it here you can see here then i go to the insert and again i choose the shapes and click this rectangle shapes here and draw the shapes something like this you can see then up it here something like this and go to the edit shapes option and click this static point here and down it maybe like this you can see just down it a little bit you can see here and this is a little bit off here this one shapes is maybe the little bit here something like this so you can see then click the shapes and go to the format and click the shape outline make it no outline here and choose the color something i choose this one color it here then go to the shape out sorry click this same background and click the send back here you can see these are properly back to here maybe like this and put your company's logo on this area Go to the insert and click the choose your pixels here something i choose this one over here and click the insert and you can see here then decrease the height here over you can use this height maybe like this i use this area something like this you can see here then type your business headline on your flyer headline here then go to the insert and again choose this the war art style also here then go to the home and click this the text box style also here you can see and then i choose this text box style is here and then click this the here and type your something like this you can see then select the overall of this text press ctrl a and increase the height here you can see here maybe like this and drag it here and change the font style also here whatever you want any font style is the using this design you can choose any font style maybe i choose this font style is here something like this and change the font color also here and go to the format and change this the font color also here something i choose this one color is here better now you can see and go to the again click home and choose the text box and click this text box and simply like type this you are here and select the text and increase the height maybe like this and drag it here maybe like this and a little bit increase the height something like this and change the color i choose this the white color something like this and change the font style also here and little bit decrease the height you can see maybe like this then go to the insert and click this the shapes and choose this rectangle shape here and zoom it and draw this shapes something like this here you can see here and little bit decrease the height maybe this something here and click the shapes go to the format and choose the font sorry shapes color here i using this one color and no outline is here something like this and press again this shapes and press ctrl command D duplicate here and drag it here and little bit increase the height maybe like this one is the battery is here something like this and click this text and press ctrl or command D duplicate here and drag it here maybe like this and change the font color something i choose this white color is here and simple drag this long
this one is here and select it let me increase the height maybe like this and select this here tagline use the tagline is here tagline goes to maybe like this and select this text and increase sorry decrease the height here maybe like this and select this text and press click this the right alignment here maybe like this and select all and change the font color is white color is here something like this right alignment maybe like this and click this text box drag it here and simple type here drag it here maybe like this and change the color something i choose this white color is here maybe like this and again click this text and press ctrl command d duplicate here and drag it here something like this you can see then click on this the text box here and draw this text box something like this maybe like this and little bit increase the height something to well and type your paragraph writing itself on the microsoft office word you can see here and simple i using this command is here this one is here using this command here press ctrl c copy here and i'm using this text and go to this text box and draw this text box something like this and paste it here and select all and just the sorry is the height here something like this you can see here lab and height is here maybe like this and select it and simple i since the font color is white here something like this you can see here a little bit increase this the height here and a little bit of it here something like this and select it this is the reduced size maybe like this you can see then press ctrl command to duplicate here again sorry press ctrl command to duplicate here and drag it here something like this you can see and click on this the text box and press the one and select it and little bit increase the height here maybe like this and drag it and drop it here something like this and press ctrl command to duplicate here then and drag it here something like this and change the font to and select the text and change the font color again click on this save search text and select all and change the font color is here you can use this the color something like this you can see and again choose this text box and press ctrl command to duplicate here you can see you drag it here and select it copy here and again paste it here something like this you can see and drag it here maybe like this and little bit right side it's here you can see then click on this shapes and oval shapes and draw the shapes something like this hold the shape bottom and drag it and change the color is something like this and maybe press this no outline here and zoom it here little bit increase the height maybe like this and click on this shapes sorry text and press ctrl command and click it here and drag it here and little bit increase the decrease the height here go to home and decrease the height maybe like this you can see drag it here and change the color something choose this one color is here and click on this shapes and press sorry text and press ctrl command and click it here and drag it here maybe like this you can see here and little bit zoom out it here something like this drag it here and click on this shapes and this press ctrl command and click it here and drag it here something like this you can see and click on this text and press ctrl command and click it here drag it here and drag it this one side here you can see then click on this insert sorry click on this home and click on this text box and type your website name here maybe click on this website name here www.website com.np here and drag it here later it and this is the increase the height here and choose the 
text color. You can use the any color is here. Something choose this text box and choose the value color pattern. Is this the desired and text box color is what is the whole less nice can see and this one is the color well the color is suitable now here and this also this well and click on this text well click on this text select all and choose this to well color maybe like this you can see something like the better design is for it here you can see here i hope you are understand this fire design video please like comment share subscribe my channel thank you for watching this